Well, a daughter is on a mission this morning, taking on Kmart over its decision to kick off the holiday shopping season on Thanksgiving Day. Now, in recent years, Thanksgiving Thursday has become an increasingly popular warm up for Black Friday. But what about the workers at these stores? When did they get to celebrate Thanksgiving with their families? Well, the daughter of one Kmart employee is now kicking up a fuss. And let's get to ABC's Gloria Riviera. Good morning, Gloria. Good morning, Paula. Well, a fuss is right. Now, Donna Fisher says she doesn't want to cause trouble, but she's proud of her daughter, Jillian, who says she's just over watching her mom walk out the door every Thanksgiving to go to work when she knows she'd rather be with family. Donna says she doesn't have a problem working, but she does feel pressure to be at her employer's beck and call 24-7. Kmart might want you to shop like a boss. But this morning, one of its employees' family is standing up to the boss. You're taking away so much from people's families. Jillian Fisher launching an online petition asking the retailer to give its workers Thanksgiving Day off so that her mom, along with thousands of others, won't have to miss out on spending this holiday with family. There's no choice in it whatsoever. Shoppers are flocking to the petition like a blue light special. Already more than 1,500 have joined Fisher in asking the company to rely on employees employees who volunteer to work the holiday. Kmart announcing its stores will stay open 42 hours straight from 6 a.m. on Thanksgiving all the way till midnight on Black Friday. It breaks my heart. It really does to see that this is all, you know, about the money. It's not about the Thanksgiving. In a statement to ABC News, Kmart says Donna is aware of her schedule and her manager accommodated her preferred shift on Thanksgiving. Kmart adding that most of its customers like the holiday hours. <laughs> In 2013, Walmart workers at 1,000 locations took to the streets on Black Friday, demanding better hours and wages. While malls and shops in some states are working around laws that ban or restrict opening up on holidays. I think we should all have the ability to say, I don't want to work Thanksgiving. There have been similar protests at Walmart in 2012 and 13. Last summer, Walmart CEO Bill Simon addressing employee grievances at a shareholder meeting, saying Walmart is listening. It should also be said those 2013 protests did result in some policy changes, a win for employees on things like pregnancy and scheduling. But Walmart is bracing this year for even bigger Black Friday protests. Dan, Paula? Gloria, thank you. It's an emotional issue, to be sure.